Eyo, 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 what's up? Ah, baby. Boy, we shot. Back again. I'm going to show you how to move wash the style. And I'm going to show you the results afterwards. All right? Ah, boy. Roll the intro. Let's see how I'm looking right now. Remember my wave commandment on rag and no more than six seconds. Right there. First things first, I am going to take my shirt off. Now I'm spraying my hair. So you always use one of these spray bottles, spray your hair, get it wet. As you see, I'm pretty low peroxidity, so. Now, next step, you don't get one of these tangled brushes. And this is the fun part. You don't want these brushes for like dollar tree. The whole point of this is to loosen the knots of your hair. Now, I don't recommend doing this part if your waves are not really trained. Now, this next step. You get a shampoo, right? Shampoo. But it's not so big of a mouth, like that much. Probably. You know, scramble wash. So as you notice right now, it looks like I have nothing on my hair right now. It looks like I ain't put no shampoo in my hair. Because right now my hair is kind of dirty. So there's no lather right now. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna rinse this out. And then I'm gonna do the next step. Time to rinse. Now next step. Gonna do this again. Get shame on shampoo. Over your hands. And then push out to here. Actually this time I'm just lathered it up but my hair is cleaner. Alright? Lather it up now. Make sure your hands are dry the whole time. You don't want to wet hands during this process. But see the magic of waves though? I have all this hair, but ain't even notice it because it's all laid down. That's the magic. Now you take your brush. You do a brush session. You want to be most careful. You don't want to put too much pressure on the brush when you're brushing your hair while it's wet. When you're brushing waves, while it's wet, a little bit more sensitive. So be mindful of that. It's best to use like a medium or hard brush for this process. It's gonna brush with your pattern, like you normally do.
this thing you also use it to bounce back as well too. Yeah, so your you crown area, you're gonna be super careful because this hair is very sensitive when it's dry. So when it's wet, it's even more sensitive. Yeah, your best bet is to use a hard brush for this because it will pull your hair a little bit better. Definition back a little bit. So this time I'm a rinse from wrist with the pattern. So you are back. Oh by the way, this is your perfect time to wash your forehead. If you haven't washed your forehead yet, just like use your hand, just move with the pattern, file everything down. You kind of like your plastic back method. That's why I, that's why I said you try to keep your hands as dry as possible because doing this with wet hands is not going to be as effective. Let me some more shampoo again. So this time I'm going to put some more. Then I'm doing it with the pattern. UV shampoo is like kind of like your pomade in a sense to hold everything down. You want to see frizz on your hair. That's fine. So next part you're gonna take a wig cap, a mesh one. Okay, you're gonna rinse in the shower. Take a mesh one, and then you're gonna put it on like this. You're gonna start from the bottom right here. Okay, you're gonna try to avoid touching your crown with this. Right, put it on. Start from, start from right here. Try to stretch it out. Try not, try not to touch your crown as much as possible. All right, like this.
wood now. I want to give it a nice hold. I'm going to keep it crowned in place as much as possible. Like when you do with your regular do rag, make sure the lines on, are on the outside. All right, bring it down. And now I'm about to jump in the shower. I'm gonna see you in a couple of hours. Or uh, when my hair dries up, which will be like it, maybe an hour or two or three. Who knows? I'll see you soon. All right, I'm back. Back was to the shower, right? Watch all the shampoo out, all that. You already know. And then I just I dried my, my weight cap a little bit, put this mesh glue rack on top of that, and just waited a couple hours for it to dry. Now let's see how things are looking right now. Remember, under six seconds. Alright, guys, if you watch the style, make sure you just shampoo with some kind of oil in it. Most of them do. Make sure you want with some kind of oil in it. Alright? That being said, like, comment, subscribe, share it with your peoples, and I'm gonna see you next. To be continued.